Hey guys, today I want to show you three profitable SaaS ideas you can use to build your next SaaS and start making money online. But before we get into that, this is the last week you can use code LAUNCH15 to get 15% off my next JS uh, SaaS boilerplate. So to get into the video, the first idea is to create um, a boilerplate of some kind that you can sell uh, to other developers. So think of anything that takes a long time to set up, for instance, setting up a Next.js SaaS project um, or setting up a Node.js backend or anything like that. Create that, make it as generic as possible, and then you can sell that to other developers who want to speed up the process. So that's what I did with sasplanet.org. So as you see here, I'm selling a Next.js SaaS boilerplate, um, which has made a ton of money, and you can use fit, uh, code launch15 to get 15% off. But this is selling well because it saves people time and gets them uh, to building their own features faster. So the value I'm providing uh, help is sells itself basically. So if you can build something like this which will save developers time, it will be a no-brainer uh, when people are on your website whether or not they want to buy it. So some pros to this are it's easy to sell and you can price it fairly high. So I can price this at $129 or $99 just because of how uh, how much utility it brings. Um, if, you're, if you made something smaller, you'd have to price it down. Or if you made something bigger, you could price it even higher. Uh, some of the cons are it does take a while to build, so you have to build it first. Uh, mine took a couple of weeks to build out, and you have to have experience. So you have to know what you're doing before you can sell something on a subject because you don't want to build something that's not going to help people um, or else they might ask for a refund. So the second thing you can think about building is a platform for AI and machine learning. So a lot of people are starting these AI companies uh, and need somewhere to train their models. So if you start something to help people do that easier, uh, more efficient, uh, people will pay a lot of money for this. So one of the examples is Bench AI. So what they do is they help you train your machine uh, learning model. So you upload the code and then they train it for you uh, on their cloud. So as you see here, they're billing uh, at $1 an hour all the way up to $39 an hour. So some pros of this are you can price it very high, like they're charging $39 an hour. Um, and it's very in demand because a lot of companies are getting into AI and are going to need a place, a uh, platform to train and host their models on. Some of the cons though are it's gonna be pretty expensive to set up because you will have to buy the infrastructure for it. And you must be experienced in that field. So if you must have experience and you must have some starting capital to actually get the platform off the ground. But um, if you do set it up right, I mean, there's a lot of money to be made in the AI field. The third idea is an AI integration into a specific niche. So a lot of people are just creating generic AI chatbots um, using ChatGPT. That field is so saturated that pretty much you're destined to fail if you start one of those nowadays. Because um, everything is, everyone can do that. I mean, I could do that, you know, just in an hour with ChatGPT. So what you want to do is you want to find a niche, uh, for instance, lawyers, dentists, um, anything in the trades like plumbers. And you want to go to them and say, I can build a chatbot or something like that. Uh, just for you, for your specific needs. Um, and the pros of this are it's very in demand. A lot of people, uh, if you sell it right, you can say it will save you time. You won't have to respond to these people. And it's fairly easy to set up. Uh, the cons are even though you're going into a niche, it's going to be saturated because just so many people are doing it. But um, if, you can, if you can position yourself right and have a good looking website and um, can talk clearly and, and really sell the value on what your chatbot or AI integration can do, uh, you'll be able to convert a lot of people. And this doesn't just have to be chatbots. It can also be like autom AI automation, for instance, reading an email and sending a summary or creating a legal document for a lawyer. So those are just um, some of the ways you can add AI into a niche and make money from it. So just go into a niche, uh, think what can be a what can AI do for this, and then create something around that. Um, and you can charge pretty highly 
uh, not as high as creating an AI platform, but you can definitely charge $20 a month, $30 a month uh, to integrate AI into something like that. So those are my uh, top three profitable uh, SaaS ideas that I've thought of recently. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and be sure to check out my website, sasplanet.org.